Ever wondered why Elon Musk, one of the most influential entrepreneurs of our time, is so keen on colonizing Mars? This question has intrigued many, and not without reason. After all, Musk isn't merely dreaming of sending a few astronauts on a round trip to the Red Planet. No, his vision is much grander, much more audacious. He envisions a future where humans have become a multiplanetary species, with a self-sustaining colony of a million people living on Mars. This ambitious plan is known as the Mars Plan, and it's a testament to Musk's relentless dedication and his unwavering belief in the potential of human innovation. It's an idea that has captured the imagination of the world, a notion that seems straight out of a science fiction novel. But has this grand plan been as smooth as Musk envisioned? Let's take a closer look. Elon Musk's journey towards Mars began in earnest in 2002 with the founding of SpaceX. This marked the beginning of an ambitious endeavor to make human life multiplanetary. The timeline we're about to traverse is dotted with both triumphs and tribulations, a testament to Musk's unyielding spirit. In the early years of SpaceX, the focus was on the Falcon 1 rocket. The first three launches in 2006, 2007, and 2008 unfortunately ended in failure, each for different reasons. These were tough times for SpaceX, but they were also times of intense learning and growth. The fourth attempt was a success, and Falcon 1 became the first privately funded liquid-fueled rocket to reach orbit. The next chapter began with the Falcon 9, a larger, more powerful rocket designed to carry heavier payloads. But the journey wasn't without its hiccups. In 2016, a Falcon 9 exploded during a routine pre-launch test, resulting in the loss of the rocket and its payload. It was a stark reminder of the inherent risks and challenges in rocket science. Then came the Starship, the key to Musk's Mars plan. This massive spacecraft is designed to carry up to 100 people to the Red Planet. However, the path has been anything but smooth. There have been a series of test flights, many of which ended in fiery explosions. Just recently, there was another unsuccessful flight that saw the Starship prototype fail to stick its landing. But remember, in the world of SpaceX, failure isn't the end. It's an opportunity to learn, iterate, and improve. Each explosion, each unsuccessful landing, they all contribute to a better understanding of what it takes to reach and perhaps colonize Mars. Despite these failures, Musk remains undeterred, but what do these setbacks tell us about the Mars plan? As we delve deeper into this timeline, it becomes evident that this journey is far from over. It's a story of resilience, tenacity, and a relentless pursuit of a dream that could forever change our place in the cosmos. Failures, they say, are stepping stones to success. But in the case of Musk's Mars plan, could they be warning signs instead? Let's delve deeper into the setbacks that have marked the journey to Mars. The first failure that comes to mind is the technical challenges. After all, we're talking about colonizing an entire planet. The hurdles are colossal. It's not just about getting humans to Mars, but ensuring they can survive and thrive there. From the need for a sustainable oxygen supply and radiation protection to the lack of viable food sources and extreme weather conditions, the technical obstacles are numerous and daunting. Then, there's the financial aspect. The Mars plan is a high-budget venture. Musk himself has admitted that it might cost as much as half a trillion dollars. That's a staggering sum, even for a billionaire. And it's not just about the money, but the opportunity costs. The funds and resources poured into the Mars plan could arguably be better spent on pressing issues here on Earth. Next, we have to consider the skepticism from the scientific community. Many experts have raised doubts about the feasibility of the Mars plan, citing the myriad technical and logistical issues that we've just discussed. Some have even voiced ethical concerns, questioning the morality of colonizing another planet while we struggle to take care of our own. Lastly, the failures have also had a psychological impact. The repeated setbacks have raised questions about the credibility of the Mars plan. Each failure chips away at the confidence of stakeholders, including investors, employees, and the public at large. Now let's be clear. Every ambitious project is bound to face failures. They're part of the process, but the magnitude and frequency of the failures associated with the Mars plan are disconcerting to say the least. Are these failures mere bumps on the road to Mars, or do they suggest a more serious issue with the Mars plan? Given these challenges, is it fair to label Elon Musk's Mars plan as a failure? Let's dive into this. The Mars plan, ambitious as it is, grapples with significant logistical, technical, and financial challenges. For starters, the logistics of sending humans to Mars are daunting. The journey itself is long and perilous, with numerous risks including exposure to radiation and the effects of long-term weightlessness on the human body. Then there's the technical aspect. 
developing a spacecraft capable of carrying humans to Mars and ensuring their survival, not just on the journey but also once they arrive, is a feat of engineering that's yet to be achieved. This isn't a jaunt to the moon, it's a voyage to another planet, one that's inhospitable to human life as we know it. And let's not forget about the financial hurdles. Funding such a venture is no small task. The Mars plan is a massive financial undertaking with costs potentially running into the hundreds of billions of dollars. That's a hefty price tag even for someone as wealthy as Musk. Adding to these challenges is the timeline. Many experts consider Musk's timeline to be overly optimistic, if not downright unrealistic. The criticisms from the scientific community have been vocal and persistent, with many questioning the feasibility of such a grand plan. But despite these obstacles, Elon Musk remains undeterred. His belief in the Mars plan is unwavering. He's faced criticism and setbacks before and yet, he presses on, driven by a vision of a future where humans are a multi-planetary species. So is the Mars plan a failure? That depends on your perspective. It's true that there are significant hurdles to overcome and the journey so far has been anything but smooth. But to label it a failure at this stage might be premature. Whether you view these setbacks as mere teething problems or signs of a doomed plan, one thing is clear. Musk's journey to Mars is far from over. Please do like share and subscribe to my channel.